Hello and welcome to the workshop. Thank you for stopping by. We appreciate you very, very much. Now, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. We upload a brand new video, Buckets. Almost every single day. Almost every single day. That's a lot of sneakers. So if you are a sneaker lover or even a sneaker liker, you have come to the right place. I promise you that. Also, if you enjoy today's video, please hit that thumbs up button. Really does go a long way. And if you're looking for me outside of YouTube, you like that little maneuver right there? Yeah, a cyclone. Exactly, a cyclone. Um, Twitter and Instagram, at Mr. Fomer Simpson, right there. Bang. That's where you can find me. I got nothing else. Should we dive in? I'm excited about this pair of sneakers. Let's dive in. Three, two, one, bang, bang. This is the Kith Nike Air Force One New York Knicks. These released a few weeks ago and retail was $130. Now, if you know me, you know I am a huge New York Knicks fan. I know. Cue the sad music. Cue the Adele. I am a little biased. That's the point I'm trying to make. And I think this is a very underrated sneaker. So, um, Buckets, you've jumped off the Knicks. A New Yorker. Born in New York City. And you turn your back on the Knicks. I had to leave. All right. So, Buckets is no longer a fan. I am still a fan. I'm going down with the ship. Um, the ship's been down, kid. Yeah, I'm underwater with it, with the violin. I'm just down there. Submerged. Me and the captain. Okay. Not the captain. I don't like the captain. I'm just down there by myself. Uh, captain, was he a bad guy? No, I'm talking about the captain of the Knicks, Dolan. Oh. All right. Back to the sneaker. When I say they're underrated, I'm talking about, I guess, with the masses. I think Kith sneakers in general, they're a little more niche as far as the following, as far as the consumers. And I mean, I guess that should go without saying, Nike is a much bigger brand than Kith is. But Buckets, do you think that's accurate? The, the, the Kith stuff, even when it's really, really dope and there's kind of a frenzy around it, it seems like still a very, it's almost like a niche within a niche. Highly concentrated. There you go, exactly. Highly concentrated. Either way, they have done some really dope stuff over the years. I'm a fan, 100%. I remember back when Ronnie Feig first started doing collaborations, most of them with Asics, and I had almost every pair, literally, from the Salmon Toe to the Leatherback to the Knicks ECP pair, another New York Knicks colorway, by the way. Like I said, yes, I am biased when it comes to orange and blue. But beyond the colorway on this one, you have the classic Air Force One silhouette, obviously. This model speaks for itself. Also, very good quality leather, premium feel for sure. But what really gets me with these, what really draws your boy in, the swooshes. I love everything about them. The shape, the gradient fade, the orange on one side, blue on the other. It's just a really, really dope look. A few more details, because this is a simple sneaker, but you got the Kith Air Force One on the tongue. NYC on the side with the mini orange swoosh. Kith Air embroidered on the back. That's another very dope touch. Classic white midsole with the clear icy bottoms. Super clean. I like them a lot. Speaking of icy, put these on ice and break them out in the summertime. It's hard to beat 
a white Air Force One in the summer. It just is. These obviously do have a little bit of color, a little bit of spice and pizzazz, but at the end of the day, it's a mostly white Air Force One and the nice leather doesn't hurt either. I love that you can still find them for pretty cheap. I see them going for right around, I don't know, 175 bucks, 200 bucks, right in that range, depending on the size. And they're well worth it, in my opinion. So, scale of one to 10, moment of truth. What am I going to give these? I gave the Bodega Dunk a nine yesterday. People weren't happy about it. Uh, people, uh, you know. I thought that was one that like people were gonna be on board with. Highly concentrated. Highly concentrated, yeah. There was highly concentrated- uh, Anger. Yes, directed at me. Yeah. <laughs> um, now I'm gonna say, man, see it's tough for me because collaboration wise right hear me out hear me out collaboratively these are probably not what those are for sure there's like the amount of details and etc yeah the details the way it's put together but i think for me this sneaker is a lot more wearable okay. so it's like damn but i don't really think this is a nine so did i was the bodega too high i don't you know these are the things man these it's it's uh it's tough a lot of pressure right here, okay? It backs into a corner. Man in the arena. Okay. All right? LeBron James. I'm going to give these eight and a half. I'm going to give them an eight and a half. I think it's a dope sneaker. It's representing New York City where I'm from. So uh, I'm into them. Eight and a half. Buckets, what's your story, kid? My story? Uh, got a long story. As far as a rating, I give these an eight. An eight? Yeah. All right. Me and you have been in the same range, all right? I mean, we're generally in the same range. I've pulled you out of the dungeon. No, I mean, these are not a four, so I'm not going to give them a four. Okay. If it was a four, I'd give it a four. They're an eight. All right. It's a good sneaker. Leave a comment below and let us know how you feel. What are your thoughts on the Air Force One? What are your thoughts on this colorway? So this colorway was released, uh, I guess, in unison somewhat or a coordination with the City Edition uniforms ronnie designed uh ronnie and kith i should say uh they designed the new york knicks city edition uni yes and so then it made sense uh that these released as well let us know what you think uh if it's nick slander i'll i'll have you know i'm numb to it i've heard it all uh do your worst okay do your worst leave a comment below we always love to hear from you thank you for watching very very appreciated we will be back tomorrow manana same time same place right here at the workshop with a brand new sneaker for your head top i got nothing else buckets anything from you no adios